All right, guys, so find some bagels because I'm really hungry today. Hmm. I wonder what type of bread that is. Hey, brother, how about you try some of my bagels? I'm Dave of Dave's Killer Bread. The more killing there means that the bagels are so good that they're going to murder your mouth. Well, not like Captain Crunch, which actually kind of stabs your mouth, obviously. It's like knives, I heard. Uh, yeah, I don't know, Dave. I've never really seen you nor your bagels before, so I'm actually kind of scared. Brother, tell me any other bagel bag that has a man playing a guitar. And it's not just any man. It's a cool, hot, sexy man. Well, that does like a pretty sweet guitar. Plus, you sound like Hulk Hogan and you look like Dutch Vanderlyn from Red Dead Redemption 2, so you pretty much already convinced me. All right, I'll try one of your bagels. Looks good already. Now let's put some of the stuff back. All right, where I put this? All right, it's hard to eat this bagel. How's the bagel over there, brother? Yeah, yeah, you know, this, these bagels are actually kind of good. Let me get my second one. <laughs> yeah, I like taking some of my organs, brother. It looks like you forgot to chew your food. <laughs> I gotta work my evil laugh. Oh, right, I'm gonna go call the boss. Oh yeah, VeggieTales. Yeah, VeggieTales. Man, I love VeggieTales so much. Honest to God, if anyone were to have ever gone against it, I will immediately slaughter them and their entire family. I don't even care for their children, man. I will slaughter them. Excuse me, sir. But I immensely apologize for any inconveniences within entering your room. You have a caller. I mean, well, I mean, sure, I will accept the call, but why do you have a, a glasses case for a phone? Again, I apologize, sir. But unfortunately, I am required by a random civilian to not tell. Ah, well, that makes a lot of sense. Well, I guess I'll just take this phone and you're relieved for the rest of your day. Well, then good day to you, kind sir. I must go to Pandora and listen to Wolfgang. Wait, you listen to Wolfgang? As in, Wolfgang on Mad D.S. Mozart? The music composer? Um, yeah, something like that. Wolfgang, 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 About to go and free slaves. I'm going to be a guy named Dave. Wolfgang, 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 Wolfgang. Hello, it's me, Chef Boyardi, the most famous Italian mob boss and also the gang leader of the most famous Italian gang of food, the Chubo Chokers. With our most famous motto, chew first, then swallow. Oh, Dave, what's up, my man? How you doing with the business? Oh, you killed him. Oh, thank God. That guy was a pain in the neck. Never chewing food, just swallowing everything. Everything whole. What a, what a choking. Yeah, he deserved to die. All right, well, that's good then. What, what are you about to do now? Okay, you about to go do your bagel business some more? All right, you go do that. Good job. You uh, you deserve the rest of the day off. Go go do whatever you want. I'm gonna go finish looking at veggie tails. Well, I think we learned a valuable lesson today. Isn't that right, Larry the Cucumber? That's right, Bob the Tomato, my succulent, beautiful vegetable fruit friend, whatever you are. <laughs> 
Anyways, today we learned that whatever ethnicity you are, or color, or mixed gender you are, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter who you are, because wh whoever you are, you still gotta know that you're gonna be forever of Christ. But wait a second, I'm a banana! Does that mean I have a purpose too? No, build a banana. Everyone has a purpose except for you. You can't be with Jesus because you're an inappropriate icon to the Holy Bible. What are you talking about, dude? You're Larry the Cucumber. You're used inappropriately as well, probably. Bill, you must be mistaking me for a green banana or a pickle because I don't, even, I don't even know what you're talking about. I've been here for so long talking about the Bible and how Jesus means everything to me. Hey, wait a minute. Aren't you the exact same guy who turned himself into a pickle? The power of Christ compels you! Hey, the power of Christ compels you! <laughs> oh wait, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Oh wait, you are the male term over to a pickle. Uh.